Goodbye, Dulles International Airport. Hello, Trump International Airport. A group of Republican lawmakers, none of whom, by the way, are from Virginia, are calling to change the name of the airport. Homa Bash is live at Dulles right now to explain why. Homa. Yeah, Jim. Okay, so the proposal, as you said, would be to go from Dulles International Airport to Donald Trump International Airport. Of course, people have strong opinions on this one way or the other, including Congressman Jerry Connolly, whose district includes part of Dulles. It's kind of a disgusting exercise. It will go nowhere, but it will serve their po political purpose uh, in, uh, in trying to win more favor from Donald Trump. So the proposed bill is short. It's just two pages. It gets right to the point. It was proposed by a Pennsylvania Republican and co-sponsored by six other GOP lawmakers in the House, again, none of whom are from this area. Dulles Airport, one of three in the DMV region, is named after Secretary of State John Foster Dulles, who served in the Eisenhower administration. It's had this name since it opened back in 1962. DCA, or Ronald Reagan Airport, of course, is named after our 40th president. Representative Connolly says this all feels like deja vu. He recalls when, during the Clinton administration, Congress renamed National Airport after Reagan amid threats of cutting off federal funding if they didn't. Well, as for airport goers we spoke with, there are, of course, two sides here. Yes, Donald Trump! I'm a Trumpster from 1984. He deserves it. He earns it. It's a shame what our country is going through right now. It's despicable. So you'd be happy to be here at happy. Trump International? Blissful. Blissful. We'll put a Donald Trump wrap on my car to be sitting here honoring him. It's brilliant. I, I prefer it the way it is. I think Dulles is a better name for the airport than naming it after the former president. I guess I'm not a big fan of Donald Trump, and, and I don't think it's appropriate to name stuff after him after all the controversy. So no word yet from the Trump campaign on this legislation. The Republicans have a razor-thin majority in the House, but as for the Democrat-controlled Senate, this bill is likely dead on arrival. Guys. All right, well, that brings us to a Fox 5 Live Instable question. Should Dulles International Airport be renamed after former President Donald Trump? 72% of you, a bigly margin, say no. 28% of you say yes. You can weigh in by scanning the QR code on your screen, going to fox5dc.com or voting in the Fox 5 News app.